hi all today in this lecture we will talk about the micronaut framework which is another jvm based framework and how it is different from the other frameworks and what are the advantages so this is the first tutorial from the uh, beginners tutorials for the micronaut okay so micronaut framework is basically the jamas full stack framework for building your modular easily testable microservices based applications and serverless based applications so basically micronaut comes into the picture so the, the developers behind the micronaut framework who are they develop the grills framework which is the groovy based framework which has so they have the experience uh, of uh, developing the framework jvm based framework and they know the pros and cons over the existing frameworks and the best they choose from the existing framework and they develop the micronaut so micronaut comes into the picture when, when, when uh, we have m heard more about the uh, micronaut is using the very minimal memory footprint and they have certain key features like it's natively cloud native so what exactly means by natively cloud native it it, uh, it is supporting from scratch the cloud native development when you develop any serverless applications or microservices based application that you can easily deploy on any cloud provider so they have the inbuilt uh, cloud runtimes and they have the polyglot framework which is also helpful when you when you when you want to develop the framework with the help of the graal vm or uh, you have the smooth learning curve because they are using the existing nomenclatures which are, which are there with the spring and spring boot and the another uh, certain another features like react native supports and non blocking http servers with the netty and few other things about the spring they have the micronaut data framework like a similar like a spring data so how it is basically different from the existing spring framework so spring boot is really the great framework or spring is really the great framework which is really making the developer job easy and it's a really elegant development but when we say the spring when we add the one dependency and everything is happened done so that's the magic is there with the spring boot but to do that magic spring is definitely doing so many things under the hood like proxy creation or reflection framework and so many things right and when we spring is doing that uh, 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 instead of we do that so uh, we have to pay some cost so that is in terms of a reflection framework memory footprint and so so many things so micronaut framework is not doing that micronaut are not using the reflection frameworks so instead of they using their own mechanism to do the uh, uh, development for that so i have already written the uh, uh, article on the same thing about the micronaut framework how it is supporting java groovy and kotlin and the key features about the spring um, uh, micronaut and what are the different uh, advantages and disadvantages behind that how uh, micronaut is uh, uh, easy to set up and everything i mentioned uh, you, you guys can go through this article so uh, in the next lecture we will see how to set up the micronaut framework and do the first hello world applications thank you